New at six, Stanford University has big plans for expansion and is pushing to get its permits approved. But Santa Clara County says the plans are just not big enough. KPI X 5s Len Ramirez joins us from Stanford to explain. Len? Well, unlike past permitting process that Stanford seemed to really breeze through, this time it looks like the university and Santa Clara County are headed for a fight over how much housing Stanford would be required to build. On a picture perfect day, it seems all is well on the Stanford campus, but students Shelby and Olivia say there's a crisis faced by the campus workers who serve them every day, and it has to do with housing. The workers can't afford to live anywhere close to Stanford. You're driving two to three hours to get to campus. You have to drop off your kids. You barely get any sleep. Workers are having to live in Modesto or um, somewhere across the bay. Which is why they got involved in something most Stanford students pay little attention to, Stanford's ambitious plans for growth. The university has applied to Santa Clara County for a new general use permit, which is a blueprint for developing the campus over the next couple of decades. The plan calls for 2 million square feet of new research buildings and just over 3,000 new houses units, but only about 550 of the new units are for non-students. This new general use permit is going to bring 7,000 to 10,000 more people into the area, and if, if they don't house any of those people, then we're just going to be, it's going to be a disaster. Santa Clara County rejected Stanford's plan, asking for 2,000 more housing units for faculty and staff before it can be approved. We're really trying to work with Stanford to make sure that all of the actions that they take really have a net net positive for our community positive in that they get to develop and positive in that we all benefit from that development. No one from Stanford was available for comment, but the university sent us a statement which reads, we are seeking to add a reasonable amount of housing that helps address our region's housing challenges and minimizes any adverse impacts on our neighbors. In our conversations with the county, we are trying to strike the right balance. The county is asking for the public to weigh in at a series of public hearings, the first which will take place Thursday night at Palo Alto City Hall. At Stanford, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.